In this picture we can see one whole chocolate bar, which has been divided into eight pieces and an extra three pieces. So we can write the number of chocolate bars as a mixed number, which will be one whole one and three eighths. If we count up the number of pieces we have 11 eighths. We also write the number of chocolate bars as 11 eighths. This is called an improper fraction because the top number is bigger than the bottom number. Many people call these top heavy fractions. In the next example each cake has been cut into six pieces. So we can write the number of cakes as a mixed number. One, two, three whole cakes and the fraction part is one, two, three, four, five sixths. So as a mixed number it is three and five sixths. Or we could write it as an improper fraction. We have six, then another six, which makes twelve. Then another six, which is eighteen. Then another five. So we have twenty-three sixths. So as an improper fraction we can write it as twenty-three sixths. This second diagram shows that 3 and 5 sixths is equal to 23 sixths. The first diagram shows that 1 and 3 eighths is equal to 11 eighths. So any mixed numbers can be written as improper fractions and any improper fraction can be written as a mixed number.